Hi folks, I'm Ian Baker, the product specialist here at American RV in beautiful Grand Rapids, Michigan. Today I'm going to tell you all about the 2017 Winnebago Winnie Drop 1780. The particular model behind me is going to be in the beautiful cherry red exterior. But let's go ahead and start up front, we'll make our way back and then head on in. So right up front you will see the propane tank cover, 20 pound propane tank. Uh, right behind that will be the rails for your battery. Also diamond plating here in the front. This is going to help protect your front end from any rocks or anything that get thrown up by the tow vehicle. That way they just hit this and don't damage the beautiful front end. Let's come around to the side. Uh, a couple things I love about Winnebago. One of them is going to be the exterior here itself. So as I mentioned this is the cherry red exterior. Absolutely gorgeous. And as you know Winnebago, you know they've had a great name and quality and it doesn't stop on their travel trailer line. This is going to be a true poor gel coat exterior which in the RV industry is one of the best type of exteriors you can get. It will keep that shine and luster. It's a very similar process to what you see uh, in boats, the way boats are made and as you know you know as, as long you can wax those suckers up and they'll stay looking beautiful for the life of the unit. Same thing here. Let's take a look at the front storage. Large front storage. This, this will go under the U-Dinette which we'll see when we go inside but great storage up front right here. Moving back a little ways, there will be an awning on this unit. This is a crank out awning, uh, so if you're going to have a manual awning, this is definitely the preferable way to go. Easy one person operation, you just put it up there, crank it right out and you have the awning coverage. So on a teardrop shaped camper, it's not very often you can get an, an easy to use awning. Usually if anything it's a bag awning, not the case with Winnebago, so I love that awning option. Uh, underneath that is an outside speaker, so if you want to listen to music while you're sitting out here in the shade, you can can do that as well. Uh, easy grab handle to get in, one step, but that's all you need. You know, one of the purposes of this unit is it's lightweight, it's easy to tow, so if you have an SUV you can tow it. Uh, so low profile, also the box is going to be very narrow, it's only a six and a half foot box. Big advantage of that is as you're driving down the road, you don't have to put on mirror extenders to see around the sides of it, so very cool. Uh, as we make our way back a little bit further, right back here this is something that I absolutely love. Not only do you have that huge storage up front, but take a look at this. Pass through storage in the back. Massive storage right there which is phenomenal. Uh, you know, Anything and everything you want to store there you certainly can. Also black tank flush. It's another thing you don't see very often on these smaller units. Uh, you know and that's fantastic. Instead of having to take a hose all the way through your trailer and put it in the toilet to wash out your black tank, now all you have to do is take that same hose, put it right here and that will go ahead and wash it out for you. Uh, also on the other side of the camper, on the off door side, there will be an outdoor shower with both hot and cold as well as a propane quick connect in case you want to hook up any style of grill. All right, it's going to wrap it up for the beautiful outside. Let's go check out the inside. Welcome to the inside of the 2017 Winnebago Winnie Drop 1780. This is a fantastic floor plan. It's going to be a great couples coach. And as I mentioned, we were outside very lightweight. Uh, we'll start up right in the front here. This is the Mamba interior. It's a great look. Huge U dinette. This is phenomenal. Uh, this allows, you know, if you have uh, guests, whether it's family, friends, whatever, everyone can sit around the table, have a meal, play a game together. And when it's time to go to bed, the table will drop down and this makes a very large bed that two adults can easily sleep on. Windows on both sides as well allow for a great cross breeze and LED lights throughout the coach brighten it up. Uh, let's come right around here. This is the entertainment center so when you want to watch TV, again sit right in the U dinette. You can go ahead and watch TV right here. This will be connected to your multimedia center right up here. Uh, this will control the speakers inside as well as the speakers outside and it is blue. Bluetooth capable. Uh, also this is a radio and a DVD player so if you want to watch a movie go ahead and pop it in it's hooked up to the TV right there. Uh, great storage underneath here as well. Let's scoot right on back I will show you the bathroom. Uh, before we go in I talk about this on every Winnebago I love the doors on Winnebago. Uh, you know when you go in other manufacturers when you're out there I, I uh, challenge you to test this just open and close the doors see how easy they open and close. Winnebago every time I mean look at that nice tight just phenomenal doors they put on there but let's go ahead and take a look in the bathroom here this will be a wet bath uh, right down on below will be the shower pan as well as the toilet up behind the toilet you get a great storage rack there uh, power vent fan up top LED light and you can see there you have the hand wand sink down below 
And then up front here will be the bed itself. So this will be your primary bed. Again, windows on both sides, great cross breeze. Uh, take a look underneath. Underneath you have huge storage right there. It's perfect for a duffel bag or if you have a laundry basket you wanna put under there. If you have a CPAP machine, you can see right down here there's an outlet so you can plug that in. Uh, same thing if you need to charge your cell phones, you can plug them in right there. There's actually a little shelf here on the edge of this slide. You can put your cell phones right there while they charge. Speaking of slide, you have a slide, a small camper like this, you get a slide out, how phenomenal is that? And if you take a look at the weight, it still weighs under, or it still weighs 2,700 pounds, very lightweight for having the slide out, which adds a lot of room. And also, great countertop space. You can take a look here, um, you know, right here will be your single bowl sink, but that's all you need. High rise faucet, plug in, if you need to plug in a coffee maker or anything, you can go ahead and do that. Two burner cooktop there. Great storage underneath the sink, you can see there, plenty of storage. And then because you don't have an oven here, take a look at this, beautiful full extension ball bearing drawers. They're nice and finished off and uh, very, very easy to use. You can tell it's a quality drawer. Take a look up top here, you have the nice decorative glass and again, great storage, excellent pantry storage right up there. Uh, now I did show you the weight on this unit, but take a look, I'll pop this open. Convection microwave, I love it. They removed the oven to give you the space for storage. Instead, they put in a convection, uh, which is going to cook faster, it's easier to clean, it's not gonna put out the heat your standard oven does. So I love that they put that in there. Uh, this of course will be your refrigerator, open that up for you, Dometic fridge and freezer combo. That drops down. Um, and you will notice right up here that this will run off of both electric as well as propane. It also has automatic switchover. So what that means for you is if you're running it off your 20 pound propane tank, as soon as you plug it into shore power, it'll automatically switch over to electric for you, saving you on the propane gas. All right, folks, that's pretty much it. Uh, it's not a huge camper, but this is a very well-built quality camper, perfect couples coach. Uh, as I mentioned it, 2,700 pounds, extremely lightweight. You can easily pull it uh, with a smaller or midsize SUV like a Ford Escape. Uh, you have the big, huge u dinette in front where everyone can sit around, the entertainment center, Jensen name brand electronics, you know, the full wet bath, very usable, the bed up front, a ton of storage. This is one you really have to come and take a look at. If you do have have any questions or comments uh, you can go ahead and leave those in the section below or you can always give myself Ian Baker a call here at American RV and I'll be happy to answer that way as well if you do have particular questions about the specs on the unit uh, maybe looking for length or if you're looking for price and availability I recommend you visit our website which is AmericanRV.com and you should find everything you're looking for thanks again for watching I'm Ian Baker and I can't wait to see you on the road to freedom